overall customize really showed us that implementation can be very successful across a wide variety of clinical settings, despite the COVID-19 pandemic, right? And I think what I was most surprised by is how quickly this can be integrated into routine care. Most, the majority of clinics said, you know, after the first few months, one to three months, we really had um, the system down pretty pat. And that acceptability and feasibility rates were really high. Injections are often suggested as something that could be a good option for people who have trouble sticking to daily pills. So what are the kind of ways that clinics learn to support their patients with what is really like a new form of adherence, the adherence to the, the visits? Wow, that's a great question. And I think that adherence was a, a key concern of ours, and we wanted to ensure that the patients had the right tools and infrastructure in place to help support adherence. So what we offered all the participants was a number of adherence support tools as a part of a toolkit. This included verbal information, mostly about the importance of the treatment window and the flexibility of the treatment window, that they had this plus or minus seven days in which they can come and get their injection, but it was important to come within that plus or minus seven day window. We had written information and resources. We offered reminder texts as well as um, reminder phone calls. Designating uh, staff or that is accountable and responsible for appointment tracking was also highly valued by the healthcare staff as a best practice. I have one person who was kind of coordinating and making sure that people were, were coming to clinic within that right treatment dosing window is important. 